Hey Lusune, welcome back to another video on this channel and today we will have to talk about this expert advisor, the Unibot and I will tell you what I think about this program and especially what I do not like about the program. Also make sure to watch the whole video please because um, it is important to understand like why I say the things um, that, I, uh, that I say and um, yeah, what, what, what especially I think about this program. So um, of course a lot of people on YouTube ask for a review for this Unibot EA because it is currently ranking on the MQL5 page on rank number one for the MetaTrader 5 and also on rank number two for the MetaTrader 4 which is a uh, which is a crazy ranking so it's like the EA that has the most attention right now on the whole platform so um, pretty much everyone who is on this platform had a look at the program already and you can see if we click on here you can see that also uh, really like a lot of people purchased this program already so um, the seller made a lot of money so we can we can be sure about this he made about 100k selling this program and it seems to be really really good so if we have a look at the mql5 page we can first of all um see that the reviews are really good there are a lot of reviews and um, you probably know that reviews um, can only be yeah be done if you purchase the program before so everyone who wrote a re review um, bought the product so these are not um, reviews that the seller wrote on his own these are users of the program pretty much so the reviews are really good and people are saying that they are making profits. But um, there's like the first thing that I want to tell you about the reviews. The reviews of a program on MQL5, they are really like, they probably only display the last few weeks because people on MQL5 like to purchase a program. They like to use it for a week or so. And if the program is profitable in these two weeks, you will get a good review and if it is not you will get a bad review so this is um, from my personal experience for example i have um, programs on mql5 2 and um, i have a program that made profit for the last uh, for the last month and then it had like two losing trades in a week and of course i got bad reviews or one bad re review who said this bot is not making profit so like from my personal experience these reviews often only take into account like the last weeks so for example if a program then starts to um, have a losing streak or to lose money the reviews will drop like really fast so um, yeah but still I mean I do not want to say anything bad here the reviews are really good so people who purchase this program are currently really happy with the program and obviously with the performance because the reviews on MQL5 are mainly based on the performance from my personal experience so let's have a look at the description here the bot um, seems to work with a um, artificial intelligence some kind of learning mechanism who um, oh, the, the, the algorithm for uh, artificial intelligence it usually uses data from the past in this case I think it uses price data and then um, does some calculations to figure out how the data or the prices in this case in the future might look so um, yeah this program pretty much uses historical data to figure out a strategy for the future and um, we of course do not get like the complete algorithm here and um, I think it's obviously really hard to understand or explain for such a algorithm how it really works like deep in the in the basis uh, of this algorithm so I will not be able to, to explain this and um, this is like what my main problem with the program is but we will get um, get get into this later on so let's have a look the bot um, goes through the entire history this is what I said before and it will just like analyze the history to get some uh, yeah some, some information from it so the recommended time frame is the 15 minute time frame it should work in all the major currency pairs and the leverage um, spread is not important blah 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 this is for the for the inputs but I think I will use the default inputs anyways for my testing and then we can also see some uh, performance graphs here which say that this um, program made 
like a crazy <laughs> profit um, for the for the last uh, 30, 40, 50 years here. He is using the complete history of euro US dollar. And yeah, this 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 just seems to be like uh, really, really, really good, like crazy good. Um, so yeah, also the profit factor is really crazy. And this seems to work like this for many different back tests for many different symbols you can see like here in the upper right corner all the symbols that he tested and all of them look like really really good here you can see there are some sideways movement uh, movements but it's not like an account has ever crashed and i think this is typical in some way for <clears throat> mql5 uh, back tests or the like the screenshots that you put on your mql5 sales page because why would you place a screenshot here where the program crashes the account that doesn't really make sense i mean also like for my uh, product that i put on mql5 of course i choose backtests that are quite good and that do not look like shit because you kind of want to make your program look sexy for the uh, for the viewer and you want people to download the free demo and test it on their MetaTrader 4 or MetaTrader 5. And this is what I did. So of course I downloaded the free demo already and here it is. I am in the MetaTrader 5 now in the strategy tester. I see the Unibot here. I use the US dollar. I will test for the current here in the M15 charts as it is recommended. And let's have a quick look at the settings. There are several settings that you can make. Um, yeah, for example, the money management, this is like a typical input block where you can say that you want to increase like the lots uh, with uh, increasing um, balance in your account and how fast you want to scale the lot size and then you have a take profit and a stop loss setting this is really interesting because um, since there is a stop loss setting this means pretty much that this doesn't seem to be a classical martingale grid system because these systems often do not use a stop loss at all but here we see a stop loss which is like mm, the double amount of i think this is points or something as the take profit so this is a good sign i would say because this is not like a full risk all or nothing program at least it looks like this from the from the settings and then we have some kind of trading stop also so we will have a look at this later on also we can say that we want to cut the losses or we want to close all positions i think if we lost 30 percent or one 30 percent of our account this is also really good for high risk systems and um yeah also we can choose the time frame we can choose the type i mean i don't really understand all of these things um because um yeah, I can just um, see what, uh, what what you see here for the inputs. So I will not be able to explain everything here. Um, and then we have some general settings. You will find these in most of the EAs, for example, the magic number, the comment. And yeah, then these are just some settings uh, like to, to handle errors and stuff like this. And we can have a maximum spread and uh, um, yeah, a, a minimum spread, I think. So yeah, and we have some logging, which will, of course, will not have any influence on the program, but this is just um, for giving us more information in the uh, expert journal, I think. So these are the settings. There's, there are quite some things we can, we can, uh, uh, we can configure here, for example, take profit and uh, stop loss, which I really like um, for a high risk system. This is always good to have a stop loss. But I think most important for us to have a look at the program itself and how it works. So I will just start the program and um, yeah, we will see how this program would have performed like in the in the current year 2022. So um, yeah, I will just speed this up and you can see this strategy opens multiple positions. Um, like it, it pretty much decides what direction it wants to trade, for example, buy or sell, and then it just opens multiple positions. And um, I mean, I don't really see a logic for this, but this is hard to, uh, to, to figure out without seeing the code, right? So we are just opening more positions pretty much. And then at some point when we, for example, hit the trailing stop or when, I mean, the, the program, I, I will not be able to understand the logic like completely, but at some point we just close and in most cases, I think we will close 
with a um, with a profit. And what is really interesting here is that we seem to always find the perfect high or low for the entry. And this is um, the main problem that I personally have with this program. That doesn't mean, and I want to stress this, I, I don't want to say this program is bad. I don't want to say do not buy it. I, I don't want to say anything. But my personal problem is that I do not understand the program and it looks like it is pretty much able to figure out the highs and lows or the, the, the mm, turning points of the price nearly perfectly. And this is what is weird to me because I was never able to figure out some kind of algorithm who is able to do this or not at, at such a precision. And this is maybe because I'm just not good enough. Maybe I didn't find the right algorithm yet. But this is what I think is, um, it looks some somehow too good to be true. But I mean, again, I do not want to say this system is bad. This is just my personal opinion. And I do kind of do not believe in these kind of systems that work like too perfect. But um, yeah, this is like my my issue and not your problem. So if you think this program might perform good in the live training account and by looking at the reviews, it does, obviously. So a lot of people are making money with the program right now. Um, so it, it um, might be just my problem and my um, the limits that I have in my mind. But also um, make sure to, be, as a, uh, I mean, before you purchase this program, make sure to remember that this is some kind of high risk system that uses a lot of positions and mm, kind of always wants to make a profit. And this is typical for Martingale grid systems. And these systems usually win most of the times, but then sometimes you will have a really, big, really, really, really big drawdown and you will lose a lot of money. So this might be the case for this system. I don't know because I, I, I cannot um, see the code, but just make sure that you are careful. And when you buy the program, test it in a demo account first. And um, like the most important thing for me would be to compare the demo or yeah, the, the demo performance with the testing performance and see if it gives me like the exact same results or if there are some situations where the EA behaves differently in the tester than in the live trading or demo trading. And then I would have a closer look at these situations to figure out if I can really trust the program. Because I mean, of course, there are ways to manipulate and um, the author of this program, the, the seller says that this program scans the history so it's obviously pretty easy for um, the program to just trade the history <laughs> if it if it scanned it before. So it might be easy to just um, make like perfect trades in the history when you scanned the history before, obviously. So uh, the, the big question is if this program is able to like um, replicate these good results in the live trading account. And this is what I cannot answer. This is what we will have to see like um, in the on the on the page here. So once or when the when the reviews become bad, this might be a sign for us that the program created some losses or big losses on accounts. But um, this will take some time, I think. And probably if it is a classical Martingale grid system, it might go good for a year or two. I mean, this is how these systems works. So um, I mean, at this point. Um, you, you already see that I'm not able to say a lot about the system. I'm just um, trying to like give you my view on this system because a lot of people ask about this. And if the next person asks me about this, I will just link this video where I pretty much say nothing about the system, just my personal concerns and what you should always um, watch out for if you are thinking about buying a product. But I'm not saying this is good or bad because I just cannot say it because I cannot really understand how this program works. So this was the test for the current year. And you can see this test was, of course, like really, 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 really good. It make, made a profit of... I don't know, this is like a thousand percent or so because I started with 
10,000 euro and then it made a profit of 180,000 roughly with barely any losses a crazy good profit factor and yeah overall this just looks like really really good in the tester and there's one last thing that i want to show you um what was interesting for me personally because um i tested another program before and this was the bonita ea i made another video for this check it out if you are interested and um we can have a look at this program too. I think I ran this program on the one hour chart, but I will run it for the for the same period, like for the current year and also in the visual mode. So this is um, something I want to show you in the end because this strategy works a little bit different. It works with, um, wait, let me speed this up a little bit. It works with uh, pending orders for the entries like limits and stop orders. But um, if we, oh man, this is such a slow program, it's crazy. Like this Bonita EA seems to do so much calculations, it's, it's a real pain to test this program. But um, yeah, we'll just wait until some cre uh, trades are created and then I will show you what I um, figured out and what was really interesting to me. Okay, so the test is still running, it's super slow, I will stop it now, but um, you can see like, the Bonita EA also opens a lot of trades always in one direction and then pretty much waits until them, uh, until these trades hits, uh, hit the take profit. And also this EA doesn't really lose. So it's always, it always seems to find like the direction uh, that the market will go like in the, in the next bars after the position, uh, positions are open. So this is like a, something that, popped into my mind when I tested the the Unibot EA. But yeah, you can make long retests, uh, backtests with both of these um, EAs with a free demo in the MQL5 store. I mean, it's there, you can use it um, for as much testing as you like. And um, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm not able to say a lot about this uh, Unibot EA, but um, I just do not really understand how it works. I um, still wanted to make this video because it was requested a lot. Um, I hope I was able to like share one or two things uh, with you that were in my mind when I tested this program. And what I would really like um, would be some kind of discussion again below this video, what you think about this program. I mean, a lot of people already purchased this program. So maybe someone can tell us uh, how the strategy performs for him, her in um, a demo or live uh, account scenario. And if it is or if it can reproduce the backtesting results for the same period. This would be really interesting for me. Anyways, uh, thanks for watching and have a great time. Good trades. Bye-bye.